arrived in Vail. And we are not just staying at a hotel room for the next three days. We have a one bedroom gold condominium. And this place is pretty sick. But before we show you the condo, we gotta unpack the car. I keep on searching for my You can say I lost my mind. I will keep on holding my head high. Even if the sky is falling. If you saw our last vlog, then you know we were at the Park Hyatt in Beaver Creek where we stayed in the hotel for three nights. And then we wanted to break up our Colorado trip and come to Vail to explore a different mountain that we never snowboarded before. And since it's so close to Beaver Creek, we figured why not? It's only 15 minutes away and we could explore two different mountains. Ready for the tour? <clears throat> Ready for the tour. It's a one bedroom condo, one bath with a full size living room and pretty full size kitchen area. So it's pretty nice. These are two closets that don't do anything. Water heaters in this one, so nothing special in there either. Here is our bathroom sink. I do think the bathroom setup in here is a little strange because the sink's kind of in the hallway, but it works. Coming over here is just a regular, normal little bathroom. Who hasn't seen one of those? Over to your left is our bedroom. Very spacious with a queen size bed. Oh, it's bouncy. <laughs> pretty nice. That's yeah, pretty good. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. And we even have our very own. Oh, door doesn't open. Snow covered patio. <laughs> not too private because the entrance is right there. Oh, wow. I didn't even realize that. Me either until we walked by. Oops. Not so private at all. Moving along on the tour, we'll get to the best part of the entire place, which is the living area. Right down these steps is our kitchen, living, and dining. We got some sofas that are inspired by Yellowstone. If you've seen the show, give it a shout out because it's very, very good. Fireplace. Goes on with just a flick of a switch. A very nice table. These chairs look pretty comfortable. A little harder than I expected, but it's very nice. A full-size kitchen with a full-size refrigerator. No more eating out for us. And the best part is we were able to pack even lighter this trip because we have a washer and dryer. And then finally, we have another patio that I used to think was private, and now after looking at the other one, I don't think this one's that private either. But it's a patio nonetheless. You're not very private. And there you have it. You might be wondering how we got this place. It's not an Airbnb. It's not through VRBO. It's actually using Hyatt points. This is part of the destination by Hyatt and it costs us 30,000 points per night and I think this this condo goes for like $600 a night so it's definitely a good deal when you're using points and if you watched our two videos ago then you know how we use points and miles to basically fund all of our travels that are not with the van. Look at this fireplace, snow, full kitchen, dinner. Oh yeah healthier it's dinner. It's nice. Lately, getting us back on track. We're detoxing a bit too. We had two nights back to back with drinking, so we need to let our body recover a little bit. What's up, you sexy man? Let's go, Ma. Good All right, welcome to the path. Got about a five, 10 minute walk to the lift. Bales claiming one inch in the last 12 hours. Not sure how much I believe that. Maybe way up there on the summit, but we'll see. It's a nice little walk though, look at this. It is. I feel like I'm in Yellowstone. Small flipping words. Right? About five minutes. I lost some people. I was 
We're gonna go down the back side of Vail right now. Look at this view behind me, it's beautiful. We're gonna tackle this mogul section here. Oh. oh, that was hard. I'm tired. Made it. That was tiring. Got the little short stick. That is ripping it. Today is Thursday. And it is packed up here. I don't know if it's because Vale, but you got, I guess, three lifts combining in one spot. So, kind of makes sense actually. We're about to hit the legendary back balls in Vail. It's basically at the back side of the mountain. And it's just big, open, white, rideable terrain. You ready? <laughs> oh, she's not used to the powder, is she? <laughs> I feel lazy. <laughs> this is all, there's definitely some fresh snow here. The knees are getting beat up. Whew. It's a workout. That was tiring. Cobble this for days on the jacket. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Oh, that's a, ball, that's a, a rest right there, you'd sink 10 feet. I pretty much fell the whole time. <laughs> what do you think about that one? That was so fun. That was so fun, Dude, but I'm look sweating. At that. Yeah, I've never look done anything like that. that. The, babe, that was your first back bowl. Yeah, that's what I said before we went down it. it. Nice. Daddy. Good shit, girly. <laughs> Appreciate Conquering it. Conquering the back bowls. You. Dude, but it ain't no joke. Yeah. There's dudes that are like, hey, we we go the whole way. Just toes down. I think you ladies are on blacks now. You got it. You down for the black? Claim it. We're not just doing we're charging blacks. No hesitation, black. Alright, Taylor, let's see you charge this. This is a little challenging. Yeah, I'm a little worried. You got it. You! Look at you! Yeah, there's some fresh powder right here. Look at this. Woo! Like the first half, I was like up on his heels. Then I just see his hips just go 
you hit it hard. And I was like, oh my God. It got real, real Mowgli after back, at one point. The back part of my right seat, about up to here, got stuck in the snow. So I was like, hold on, man. I was like trying to get <laughs> Woo. That was good. How was yours? Not bad. Yeah. Steep. Steep. We got a gnarly trail ahead of us right now. Steep moguls right here. And you got the steep rock cliff section, which I think is what we're gonna hit. That'll be sick. This one's gonna be sick. Look at this, baby. Which one are you hitting? It's so steep that you will notice it. Yeah. But I'm gonna hit, I'm gonna go through that chute. Yeah, it, it, no one's touched it. Yeah. You got it, buddy, if you want that chute. All right. I'll take it. Do it, man. I'll meet you there. All righty. Might be a little slow, but that's all good. Woo! Salt as I was hoping for. Woo. Wow. That was sick. It's flaky too. Yeah. Well, Vale said they got an inch. They just didn't specify that only the top did. <laughs> we got it though. Brad. <laughs> oh, you're so good looking. I'm so good looking. All right. Don't ruin it. Here, here. <laughs> oh, you just pulled my glove off. You just pulled my glove off. Look at that snow angel. Wow, she pretty. She actually is. With the snow board, it's kind of cool. She's snowboarding. Yeah, that's right. All right. You ready to rip? Ready. Ma? Yeah, dude. This is arguably one of the best views in Vail so far that we've seen. Okay. All right, we charging? All right, we're charging it. I love when you can dig your knee into the sand. I know. Me too. It feels like you have live all deep on Yeah. It. <laughs> so nice. This is easily the steepest run Taylor has done. It's a diamond that you're crushing. Alright. <laughs> you got caught up pretty good there. I was literally like this. <laughs> yeah, look at your tracks, they're all over the place. Yeah, it's true. Oh, that was gnarly. Oh, we're alive. Woo. Oh. You all right? You got it. Are you okay? Yeah, I just had a hit a bad edge, so I was coming to like fix myself, and you were coming down. I shouldn't at the have same cut in time. like that. Oh. oh, my shoulder. You okay? You yeah, actually probably broke my fall. <laughs> oh, you were falling either way. No, but I mean, 
I don't know. Probably not. But <laughs> oh, yeah, I shouldn't have cut in like that. I mean, it's not your fault. Oh, we got a couple good ones. She's like, I just want to be. Found I just want to be in the Olympics. Oh, just want to be in the Olympics. Oh, Thanks, you too. <sighs> so, what do we think about Vale? I like it. I like it too. A lot of bowls in Vale. It would be really fun with good snow. I mean, I, it felt pretty good the last few runs, though. Yeah, it did. Put our view down. Welcome back, guys. Thanks, Thank man. Thank you. How's it going? Good. Y'all had a good day? He did. Yeah. I'm tired now. Good morning now, little singing Ooh. No sweet. In a while since the song's been heard. I've got the coffee and Ooh, we made it. Time to take this gear off. It's time to go pick up our friends. Have a little get together at the house. And so this is Molly and Ken's van. And then that is Adam and Brittany's. The red transit. And then the gray Ford, which is diesel. I didn't even know they make these a little bit. You good back there? Are you good? Uh, Ma? Yeah, Won't you tell me about the time back in Kathmandu? You don't have to give the secret away, but what is the general idea that we're having for dinner Usually tonight? Usually we don't have it. I also think burgers, that even if we spend eggs in the morning, curtains come in. So burgers, eggs, on burgers. I saw bacon. Bacon's in the oven. Yeah. Bacon's in the oven right there. Big, big cooking. You guys are going to make me want to eat uh, beef right now. I mean, you're going to want to. Yeah. Grilled onions. It, when they do hit the pan. And then we have uh, the pre-made smash patties right there. Look at the technique, man. And be in the kitchen. Wow. Ken combos coming up. <laughs> Is that what they're called? Ken combos. Ken combos? All right. So me and my boy Rob back in Austin. Is that who you were FaceTiming? Yeah. yeah. We want to open a burger joint because he has a burger that's called a Snotty Robbie. It's really good. Really good. All right. What do we call it? Molly. Molly mashup. Molly mashup. It's a king combo with an egg. Ken <laughs> combo banging. with an egg. She loves. She it loves Friday. So good. <laughs> Does it pass the test? It's so good. <laughs> yeah. You're still gonna like it. Yeah. You gotta try. Bacon eggs. Y'all cooked, y'all clean. Oh. You guys are welcome yeah. anytime. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll miss you when you're gone. Oh, come on. Wait. Oh, I love you. 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 With the hair flip. Dude, coming out of the trenches, you were at negative one now, like two rounds ago. Uh, and then Kevin <laughs> at seven, ending on a positive, buddy. Oh. <laughs> Lucky number seven, Kevin. That was my hockey number, so. Yeah. <laughs> Our Colorado trip is closing in on us because today is the last full day here in Vail. We just got Taylor's snowboard all hooked up. The repair went well, it's much better now. And we're ready to hit the mountain today. Today's Friday, so we're hoping to get to the mountain earlier today before the crowd comes because on Fridays in the late afternoon, the weekenders come in and it gets crowded. So we're trying to hit the mountain pretty fast and we need to get breakfast. All right. You ready? We are off to the Grand Hyatt before hitting the mountain because we got restaurant vouchers for breakfast. So we figured, why not get the buffet breakfast for the last few days, yeah. But we're still a little behind schedule. Our goal was to do, hit the mountain by 8.30. And I think it's like 8.30 right now. It is 8.27. Yeah, so probably not getting on the mountain until 9.30. I wonder where uh, 
Britt, Molly, Ken, and Adam are because they are, we're claiming that they're getting on it at 11.32. 10.30. Or 8.30. Whew. <clears throat> Molly and them are up at 6.45. They were? They texted you? Yeah. Dang, maybe it'll be on there. We won't. Also, if you're not familiar with Vale, there's basically two sections of it. We're here in West Vale, which is like more residential, minus the Grand Hyatt, which is like the massive hotel with the pools and stuff. But in the main village, you have Lion's Head Village, which has a bunch of other condominium apartments, hotels, restaurants. But it's just a little too far away to get there. You ready? Uh, ready. Last ski day in Colorado. Oh, Ooh, it's coming oh, in hot. Shit. It's coming in hot. Jeez. Oh like... man, there's even Get out of here. frost on here. See the frost? Yeah, my butt's freezing. It's a little chilly. It's our, my last snow day, my last ski day of the season. And you're upset? A little. Oh, she likes skiing, everyone. You believe it. So if we had to Acid. rank our favorite Colorado destination. Aspen, Aspen Snowmass. Yeah, you gotta specify, because Aspen is not the mountain that we rode. Snowmass is dope. We did Snowmass. Okay, here's the mountains that we did. A Basin, Aspen Snowmass, Beaver Creek, and Vail. So there's still a lot of mountains that we need to hit. On the Epic Pass, there's Crested Butte. Crested Butte. Crested Butte. Breckenridge. Steamboat Springs. And Keystone. I'm not sure about Steamboat. Oh. Steamboat. Birds go, birds chili. So there's still a lot of mountains in Colorado that we haven't hit obviously, but our favorite in terms of a family vacation. Oh, family vacation. Beaver Creek. I think Beaver Creek. We didn't explore the village as much in, what's it called though? Vail. Vail. So it might be good, but I feel like Beaver Creek Beaver for kids Creek. is the best. Amazing. Uh, less populated. Yeah, less populated. Lots of greens up high. Lots of greens and blues. And it's just a fun mountain. It's a fun mountain. This, I think, is nice, but it's way more congested. And it's it's definitely a more challenging mountain. It offers uh, more diverse terrain, obviously, because it's one of the biggest in Colorado. There's back bowls and stuff, but uh, this is this is the mountain to go to with a lot of high performance folks. I feel like. And he's calling me high performance. Yeah, she's rocking diamonds. But I mean, on a powder day, this place is probably incredible. Ooh. This is the sun, all right. All right, first run of the day. Vail and Aspen take the cake for best views. Vail beats That's Aspen for best views. Come on. You think? Look at that. I feel like Aspen looks over very, there, very similar. Over there is beautiful. I mean, either way, it's just incredibly gorgeous. It's hard to concentrate on the alcohol at all times. I just want to take it. <laughs> I know. You just want to like take pictures of it and share it with people. Put a picture. All good? Conditions aren't perfect. It's a icy this. Yeah, it is. It's all right. We'll be all right. Look at all this. Uh, harder, right? harder. This is crazy. Look at this. What is Saturday like? Yeah. Wow. All right, I'm ready when you are. Yeah, yeah we, we want to get to a key. What's up, gang? Hey. How are you doing? It's going. <laughs> no. 
You guys aren't either? No. no. It's trash. You're not either? No. Man, I was hoping we'd maybe bad. get a couple runs in. We <laughs> will. A little speed will. On the way down. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dude, this is this is trash. We yeah, this, 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 this is some of the worst snow I've ever experienced in my entire life. Heavy claim, dude. Heavy claim. So it's I'm, like spring skiing right now. I mean, but dude. But with wind. It, that's the thing. We took that Orient yeah, all the wind. way down. Hey. We flew down. We were flying down through this pass right here. I'm tall. All of us were toes down, and we couldn't get no speed. The wind was just... Dang. That's probably why I couldn't get any speed up there. I'm nice. Yeah, I did three, and I'm like, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I think I'm just going to drink beer and eat Sammy's. Yeah. <laughs> dude, I want, nice, I want a nice... I want Let's go hit the terrain park, that dude. Joint. <laughs> terrain park. <laughs> we don't need good snow for I'm terrain down. park. That's true. I'm down to try some jumps. I won't do anything. Perfect. Any I'll record them all. Yeah, me too. Safely on the ground. We'll get all the angles together. All yeah. I'm down for a uh, triple cork. Adam? Wants... Triple cork, dude? Nah. <laughs> nah I'm going to pass on the triple. Uh, I'll need the dog. Adios. <laughs> no, seriously, we'll get you surfing because yeah, yeah, sure. we need more friends who surf. Sweet. We're in. Love it. We're in, dude. Right, have cool. Fun. Bye, Jay. Say bye. This is cool what they call. The husband shuffle push. The husband shuffle push. This is usually when my board gets uh, oh. broken. <laughs> Man, that was far. All those new snowboarders out there, I recommend getting yourself a Kevin. Woo! I think I got it from here. The legs are freaking tired. Oh, another husband shuffle push. Woo. I love my husband because he's so sweet. He, he pushes me down easy street. That's not what this is called, but if it was, it would have been a great freaking ride. Been fun. Been great. So, Colorado is over. Bill Village has some uh, Switzerland vibes. Big time. Oh, here it is. <laughs> we have officially gotten off the mountain, showered, and now we're going to pick up Molly and Ken for our last dinner and hopefully Dutch Blitz. Hopefully I win too. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I came in last. So I'm not really that good at Dutch play. So. Well, we'll get you working on we'll it. We'll have to figure something out there. Taylor needs to put her seatbelt on. Roger that. These trailers are. Oh. <laughs> and they still have not fixed the handle. Oh, their back hand, their inside handle is not good either. Nobody's breaking in. You! What's up? Handle's looking good. <laughs> yeah, you want to yeah. give us a tour? You have to come in through the front door. All right. All right. We just got back to the apartment and we just looked outside. It's officially dumping, of course, on the last night we're here in Colorado. <sighs> I want to extend our flight, but take a peek at this. Molly and Ken are trying to get us to extend our uh, trip, but we had a surprise 60th birthday party for my mom, so we can't adjust our travel arrangements. But that's okay, because my mom only turned 60 once. Are the doors open? Surprise! <laughs> what are we having for dinner? We are having all sorts of salad and four cheese ravioli with pesto. 
down. Cheers to making our snowboard trip a great wall of fresh. Cheers, so fun. I love it. I miss you guys. I know. It was so funny. Oh, it's so good to get out of fun. It's been great, guys. This is awesome. That wraps up our time here in Colorado. We've had an absolute blast over the last week with Ken, Molly, Adam, and Brittany. It has been a blast being able to snowboard with people. If you watched our last snowboarding series, you know that we did it all by ourselves and hung out on the mountain, just the two of us, so it was nice to actually have some other people on the mountain there with us. If you enjoyed this little mini series, stay tuned for next week's when Kevin and his friends conquer Whistler. <laughs> Watch out. Dude, I'd like to try it back. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.